Hey YouTube, it's Erin and I am the Handbag Housewife and I'm back again with another video. Today's video is going to be an update, chit chat, vlog style sort of video. I'm going to show you a few items that I have for sale in detail and then I'm also going to show you a few items that you can get on sale and then I'm just going to ask you if anybody's interested in a product I'm considering selling. So if that intrigues anybody, please stick around and I will get started. The first two items I want to show are my Willis 18 Quilty Bags. I have both of these colors. The soft metallic gold color retailed, I believe, for $4.75. I think I've used it one time. I don't see really any signs of wear. It comes with a really cute grommeted strap that has chain on the end. And I'll go ahead and try it on for you here in just a second. But this bag is fully leather lined. It has a leather slip pocket there, a zippered pocket right there, and then an additional slip pocket right there and a pocket in the back. So this little bag is small, but mighty. Let me go ahead and show you what it looks like on the body. I'm able to fit pretty much all my daily essentials in this bag, although I do have to condense my pouch into the smaller size that I show you guys from time to time, the Clinique one. I have to keep a few of the items out of pouches just so that I can organize them within the bag. And when I say all my essentials, I do put my phone vertically in this back pocket it comes a tiny bit over the bar, but if you want to be hands-free for a minute, that works just fantastic. And as you can see, it's a really cute bag. I'm 5'8", and I have it adjusted pretty much in the middle. So this bag would work if you are significantly shorter than 5'8", or if you're significantly taller than 5'8". And despite it not being very wide, you can see compared to my hand, this bag holds more than the camera style quilty, if you remember that one. So I also have this Willis Quilty 18 in the color Red Apple. This one I have never used, although I did remove the tags. Both of these are from the Coach Originals collection. And I am asking only 100 and $40 for each of these bags. Again, some of the original papers on the inside of this one in the slip pocket, as well as on the zipper pull. And I think that other piece may be behind the creed, although I can't really see it. But these bags are, other than the inside of the zipper pocket, they are 100% leather. And when I said the bar, I'm talking about this piece right here. When you put your phone in this back pocket, the phone sticks about that much over the top. So it really is just a handy way to stick your phone in if you're in the store and you don't want to hold it. And anyway, the leather on these is luscious. It feels so good. And you may ask me, why am I selling these for $140 when they cost over $400? Why don't I just keep them? Well, to be honest with you, the Longchamp Extra Small Bags hold just a little more, and I tend to gravitate towards those. So even though I love these bags, they are so soft and they hold surprisingly more than you would think. I am using another bag before I use these. So since I have such a large collection, I want to make sure that I want to use each bag and these are on the back burner. So if this is something you're interested in, send me a DM on Instagram. My name there's the same, it's The Handbag Housewife, or email me at thehandbaghousewife at gmail.com. And again, Whichever color you choose, and they both come with the strap. The strap's just inside this one. They are $140. If you did decide you wanted both, I would take $20 off the total price. All right, on to something a bit more fun. The Coach Denim Field Tote is now part of the sale on the Coach website. It does not come with this tassel here that I show on the front. I'm not selling this bag, but if you want a tassel like this, you can get it from Dress Up Your Purse. It does come with a beautiful web strap, but if you want a Vaquetta strap like this color, you can get one from Dress Up Your Purse. You can also get a navy web strap with honey trim. So there are a lot of options if you don't like a burgundy 
strap with a red stripe on the edge. But this is beautiful. I have all three options because I just, I'm just that extra, I guess you could say. But this bag, I believe it's $245 or $250 now, marked down from $350 on the Coach website. And I will link that in the description box. Now, we haven't had any very neutral soft tabby colors go on sale recently, but Zappos is having an incredible sale and they have this dove gray soft tabby and it's dove gray with granite trim and it is just stunning this is one of my favorites i ended up buying it on the resale market which if you've watched any of my real versus replica videos you know that that's a risky thing to do but i did buy it from a trusted seller that others knew and so i felt pretty darn confident about that purchase but you can get one directly from zappos so you don't have to worry about that for about what i paid which is 315 so you can order this bag currently for 315 off zappos the retail's 450 so i believe you're getting about a 30 percent discount roughly and it's stunning it also comes with a long strap with grommets that is in the granite color and i accessorize the inside of all of my soft tabbies with one of the suny bag and bag organizers that i get off etsy and again i can link that down below this was actually designed for the gucci marmont one of the styles of that bag and it was for the one that the suny bag and bag company is currently selling for 33 dollars and six cents so when you go through the drop down menu on the link i will send you just pick the one that's 33 dollars and six cents and then you'll get the one that fits the soft tabby the best at least in my opinion it's not an exact fit, but I don't think you're going to find one much better. The last thing I'm considering is letting go of my denim patchwork Marc Jacobs Mini the Tote Bag. I paid $250 plus tax, and so I would be willing to let it go for about that price. Probably, I would say, around $275 all in for the shipping of this bag from me to you. I may lose just a tiny bit that way, but I'm okay with that because I did use the bag once. So that's like my rental fee, I guess. But since I started getting the leather bags, I do not find myself gravitating to use the fabric ones as much. This bag is stunning though. And if you like soft, cuddly bags, I would certainly recommend it. I do have an organizer in it because the Marc Jacobs mini tote bags do not have any pockets if they are made out of fabric. The denim one, however, is lined and my splatter print one is lined as well. This organizer that I have is by Joy and Bag and it is not wide enough for the bag. Well, I guess I should say it is not deep enough for the bag. It's about the perfect width, but it stays right in place, right in the center, no problem. And then I'll sometimes just slide something on the sides on either side if I wanna take full advantage of the space. So I can link this organizer, but out of all the organ organizers I have recommended to you, this one probably fits the worst. It's not designed for this bag, but I do find it very handy and I plan on keeping the organizer since I do have several Marc Jacobs, the tote bags. I do also have the strap that came with this bag. It's a black strap and it has silver hardware and it's super, super comfortable. And that would be the thing I'd be the saddest about letting go because this goes with so many of my bags with the black and the silver hardware. I think the bags have actually, I think this style has actually went up in price to 275 if I remember correctly. So you are getting a good deal because you aren't paying tax and you aren't paying shipping. And that's how she looks. I always find when I do these videos and I try on these bags for you guys, Sometimes I fall back in love with the bags. And so if you want this, let me know ASAP because I won't guarantee that it'll be available forever because it'll either get snapped up really quickly or I'll change my mind about selling it. So I am one of those people that I believe if it's meant to be, it's meant to be. And if it's not, it's not. So I have these three bags left for sale. I did sell my Longchamp in the Cognac. These two are 140 unless you buy both, and then they would be 260 for both of these. This one is 275 shipped all in, 
And so all three bags are a heck of a deal. The Willis 18 quilties are a steal. Run to your email account and send me a message or DM me if you're interested in any of these. And if you're interested in either of these options, I don't know how long this one's gonna last at the sale price, and I will link it below. And again, same thing with this one. The soft tabby in the denim, like I have, it sold out before it even made it to the sale. And I think this one's probably going to be next. So don't wait too long. I'm Erin. I'm the Handbag Housewife. If you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, what are you waiting for? Do it and ring the notification bell so that you are notified of future exciting content such as this. Also, go find me on Instagram. The name there is the same. If you search for me, you just type in the at symbol, then the handbag housewife, and I'll pop right up. You can DM me there, or you can email me at thehandbaghousewife at gmail.com. I hope you have a fabulous day, and I will talk to you real soon. Bye.